So here we are in uh, the north part of the North Island of uh, New Zealand, just north of Auckland down the west coast. And I uh, just want to get a comment from Brian, how he justifies spending a weekday, an office day and a work day on a beach in New Zealand. Brian. Oh, this is where some of our best creativity comes from. With uh, we, we went for a surf this morning, then we had a nice uh, breakfast together and got together and went over some, some big picture stuff for all of us and our businesses and our lives in general. And to be honest with you, this is where our most creative ideas come from. So we're just happy to be here. It doesn't hurt getting some good, really good surf in, in between uh, our work, so why yeah, not do it here? But surely you should be in the office, you know, checking emails and, and picking up the phone and, and, you know, I mean, do you not feel any guilt being out here? Zero guilt. I don't have an office, to be honest with you. Fella. <laughs> and what about what about your uh, what about your beautiful wife? She is at home, and I wish she could be here. Uh, I just spoke to her a little bit ago, and sometimes she can make it, and sometimes she can't. But we're she's very supportive of what I do. Uh, she's an entrepreneur at heart, and um, she's home doing what she does best, and taking care of her patients. And uh, turn around and have a look at that. What do you think of people who feel guilty about taking time off, or from the office, or from their partners? I think they need to take a long look, hard look at what they're doing and why they're doing it. And the, the, the big thing for me is the why behind what I do. Um, and again, I always go back to the five Fs. Five Fs, faith, family, friends, fitness, and finance. And if you're not touching each one of those five things throughout each day, then I think you need to step back and maybe look at your priorities and how you're, how you're uh, handling your, your life and your day and your business. Pretty serious advice from one of the best investors I know who manages to get not just successful in real estate, but in my opinion, even more successful in life in general. This is us checking out from New Zealand for the moment. Thank you.